Hello, what is up folks? My name is Melvin and welcome back. So I've just happened to be really lucky with um, just having this as my day off from work because just so much news has come out today. So I've already discussed about how Microsoft bought Activision for an insane number. Uh, I think it's around like $69 billion, so around $70 billion, And it's Microsoft's biggest transaction, which Again, that's no surprise. Video gaming has just been on the rise just more and more every year. Um, and I just got really lucky as well just caring about the Activision um, Blizzard situation with how they've been harassing employees. Just how I wanted to talk about that because it was a really important story. And I just realized how much I wanted to not see these people in power anymore because it's just not fair for uh, the, this many individuals to um, create such a large company and then get treated essentially like garbage. It's just not fair and I don't think anyone should go through that. Um, and when I was originally reading articles, um, I didn't see anything that said that um, Bobby Kotick was going to be uh, kicked out as CEO, like was going to get fired or anything like that. And that disappointed me. Um, but I did see today that there is an, uh, that the Wall Street Journal posted that it kind of seems like both companies agree that Bobby Kotick won't, will no longer be CEO once the, the, the transaction is fi final, once Microsoft finally officially acquires Activision. So we can, um, this quote, Bobby Kotick, Activision longtime CEO, is expected to leave after the deal close, according to people familiar with the, those plans. Microsoft has said in its announcement Tuesday that Mr. Kotick will continue to serve as CEO of Blizzard Activ uh, as Act uh, will continue to serve as CEO of Activision Blizzard, and that after the deal closes, the Activision Blizzard business will report to Microsoft Gaming Chief Phil Spencer. But the companies have agreed that he will depart once the deal closes, the people said. Um, so I really want to give a big shout out to um, this Twitter uh, account, Nibel Nobelian, I guess. But yeah, um, seem like um, Bobby Kotick will leave. Um, I won't really post any more videos about the that situation until it's official i want to officially see that he's no longer part of the company i don't want to hear maybe even though based on how everything's been going with activision that's probably that, that's probably the best thing for them to just get rid of him and just no longer see him but again this is a very very good step forward um i'm very interested in seeing just kind of how how microsoft and uh will because again they've been just acquiring some of the biggest names in gaming and they have they have spent a pretty penny on it they really want to beat sony and nintendo at their own game they really want to be uh number one and what's interesting with these transactions i, I and this is just a side note but i'm, I'm curious because a lot of these uh, are american companies you know companies that were were made in, in america they haven't really acquired a lot of um you know, um, like Japanese gaming companies or things like that. And I'm just curious if it's because, you know, it's Microsoft's an American company and the Japanese don't want to be bought by an American company. I'm not too sure about that, but uh, that was just a side note that I noticed. But yeah, so all signs are pointing to him leaving the company and I'll be very happy about that. Um, so yay, I just thought that was a happy update. So I'm very, very happy about that. Great news. All right. Awesome. Take care, guys. All right. Bye bye.